I found a few neat things today. I went uh, to a couple of antique shops and couldn't find any record related stuff till I got to the back of the store. And then I found these um, box of cylinders, most of which were broken uh, and most of which had mold, but some were actually playable. Uh, so I went back and I got my Columbia Q just to test, and they let me test some of them out. And these are actually um, homemade cylinders, uh, obviously done by a family back around the turn of the century. And I know that because they had it stored in um, in this box right here, which I haven't had. This is one of the, this is one of the rare Edison boxes. It's the first time that his um, uh, picture appeared on a box. And this is circa 1900, and I know it is because it's in the uh, Alan Konigsberg book. And uh, as you can see, it doesn't have the patent dates on the side of it. Uh, it just says patent date 1899 under the photo. That was the first time he had his picture on the box. And then I found another one in the fourth box um, label that was ever made. And this one has a patent date of... Um, is all the patent dates, last patent date, October 1901. But this one is extremely weird because it came out in 1900 and then was quickly replaced by another one that came out also in 1900. So uh, that's the second box ever made and the first one uh, with this picture on it. Second label made, ever made. First one with this picture. So let me get to the, the uh, fun stuff. This song is called Sweet Bunch of Daisies and it's by Mrs. Bomar and Chorus. I know that because I think Mr. Bomar does the introduction at the beginning. Words are kind of hard to make out. I went online and I found the words I found the words which I will post which will make the cylinder much more easy to understand. But this gives some great historic insight as to how people used these machines and had have had some fun with them. And of course at some point here Mrs. Bomar uh, forgets the words and the chorus in the background just keeps on going which is quite humorous and at one point Mr. Bomar jumps in and he says I want my money back and then uh, it's it's pretty amusing but like it's great insight into what people were doing for entertainment back around the turn of the century okay that's enough I'll let you hear it this is Sweet Bunch of Daisies by Mrs. Bomar and Chorus introduced I think by Mr. Bomar
a splendid example of how people had fun with the phonograph back right back around the turn of the century in 1900, 114 years ago. I dare say this is the only copy in existence of Mrs. Bomar and, uh, and, and Chorus with assistance probably from Mr. Bomar there adding some uh, humor to it singing Sweet Bunch of Daisies, a song originally written in 1894 and uh, recorded uh, way back then by that uh, group of folks having a lot of fun. <laughs>